Jonathan Brown Menzies coming at you from the Time Warner Center Columbus Circle in Manhattan. Check it out, it is bustling in here, that's for sure. Everybody taking selfies, you can see them over there. Check me out, I'm at the Deutsche Bank Center. And you know they're zooming in on the other side because you got that view, we can't see it from here, but there's a nice view down 59th Street. You know what, actually I'm gonna try to get over there right now where this lady is so you guys can see the view of 59th Street from the Deutsche Bank Center. And this is what she saw, guys, looking down 59th Street. You keep walking down there, you got the Plaza Hotel, the Pierre Hotel, the Sherry Netherland Hotel. Check out these stars, they actually change colors. Mood lighting here. Now I guess they call it the shops at Columbus Circle. Back in the day, there used to be a Borders bookstore here. That was ages ago. It looks like it's been replaced by H&M. Fast fashion, you wear it a couple times and throw it in the trash. But guess what, at least we got a good bakery, coffee shop, and an Amazon bookstore. Jeff Bezos did us a solid. All those Amazon haters out there, I know what you're thinking, but hey, any bookstore is a great addition to the bookstore scene. You can go in, browse around, read a chapter, see if you like it. Here we go, Amazon Books, the shops at Columbus Circle. Let's see what we got. We got a mix of the old, rich dad, poor dad. This guy's been around the block a few times. And the new, the battle for Uber. This is current. Wellness and self-care section. I'm seeing a pattern here. A lot of titles with F-bombs in it. F-no, the art of not giving it F. And then everything is F'd. You got a magazine section. It's definitely not as big as the magazine section at Borders. And another negative is there are no benches to sit down when you're reading those magazines. Magazines. Instead of a bench, you got a stack of eco shows. Can't sit on these things. A little bit of mystery and thriller. Falling with an airplane. I don't like the looks of that. This section is dedicated to my friend Angus Northern. It's a board game called Ticket to Ride. Monopoly, the longest game ever. Big selection of toys here, that's for sure. Even ramen noodles. Is these real? Oh, ramen noodle sticky notes. Okay, something for everybody here. In my opinion, one of the best sections of any bookstore, the biography section. 90% of them are written by ghost writers, but that's okay. We got James Dyson. That might be a good book. He's an interesting guy. Pick up a whale with his vacuum. Jamie Foxx, I actually saw him on Jimmy Fallon. Really good interview. Looks like his book might be an interesting read. Matthew McConaughey. Too bad he's not going to run for governor of Texas, but still doing those Lincoln commercials. Jenna Bush Hager. That's not surprising. I always knew she added in it to write a biography. The Billion Dollar Spy. This is a book I would like to read. The regular price is $17. If you're a Prime member, it's only $14.99. But guess what, guys? You can get it way cheaper on eBay if you wait a few months and buy it used and help out the environment. A lot of different categories here, guys. Popular books in the NYC. New paperback releases. Buy two, get one for 50% off. The selections are a lot smaller than what Borders used to have and what Barnes & Noble has now. But hey, there's something about being at a bookstore picking up a physical book and reading a couple of pages that you just can't replicate on the Amazon website. Books with more than 10,000 reviews, I guess Jeff Bezos says if it's got more than 10,000 reviews, then it's legit. Kids stocking stuffers under 10 bucks, not bad. Budget friendly, parenting, and a home and garden section, plus art and design. A little bit of architecture in the mix, really nice. Got it divided by age, three and under, so if you're buying for somebody else, they got it all figured out for you. Prime members save more. You can see how much you save more. If you scan the barcode here, make sure that Prime is paying off for you. Decent travel section, gotta hand it off to Amazon. When we can travel again, this is gonna get you fired up to take that trip. New hardcover fiction, and you got cooking in the background, children's new releases, and more cooking in the background. Of course, Hallmark has a corner hollowed out within the Amazon store. 
peace, love, and pasta. Give me that chicken palm to my skull, yeah. New hardcover fiction in 2021, a little John le Carre. There's a mole right at the top of the circus and he's been there for years. Business and money, in my opinion, one of the best sections here. Looking for that new Ray Dalio book. Where is it? I don't know, it could be right in front of me. Check out this book, Food Saved Me. I don't think she was talking about the McDonald's dollar menu. She could have been, I don't know. Those cheeseburgers are pretty good. When in doubt, just remember this, you are a badass. Can be all yours for $17. 845 if you're a Prime member. Thank you, Jeff. Please rate your experience today. Well, guess what, guys? It's a bookstore. I am very happy to go to any bookstore and not buy my books online where I can actually pick up the book and test it out. Take it for a test drive. Thank you, Jeff Bezos. Also, go to all your Amazon basics, cases, cables, accessories, headphones, speakers, all the Alexa stuff, Fire TV. So there it is, guys. There you have it. The Amazon bookstore at the Time Warner Center. Now it's called something different. Shops at Columbus Circle, whatever. But it's really, really nice to be able to walk through a bookstore and browse again. The main lobby at the shops at Columbus Circle, the Deutsche Bank Center. I don't know, we may get demonetized because of this. Cover your eyes, that is some baronkadonk. The shops at Columbus Circle, open to the public, some decent stores, Amazon bookstore, a nice coffee shop up there. Guys, if you like this video, you know what to do help out the channel hit that like button right now just gonna turn around real quick give you one more shot of the lobby that's where we were up there Amazon books on the third floor another bar up there on the fourth floor H&M on the first and second floor the men's on top the women's is on the bottom William Sonoma if you like to cook they got a lot of good stuff plus J crew First Republic Bank tons of other stuff now gonna head out to Columbus Circle Iranian raw New York City evening decorated for the holidays guys leave comments below I respond to all comments do you have suggestions for this channel that's how I get ideas about new videos that I can make there it is Trump World Tower over there and it's funny the lights are on maybe on the first 10 floors then it's dark until pretty much the very top I don't know everybody's in a different spot now maybe in the Hamptons, probably in Florida, Palm Beach, right? That's where they are. By the way, check out the Palm Beach video. It's going to be right here in the top right hand corner. Here it is, Deutsche Bank Center. Guys, if you really like this video, please hit that button and subscribe right now. Thank you very much for watching, guys. Until next time, Jonathan Brown Menzies signing off.